Hi friends, welcome back to my YouTube channel, it's just Tech, and thanks for watching my videos and giving, providing me your valuable feedback in the comment box and today I'm going to share how to fix that Wi-Fi missing in your laptop, computer, okay? Just follow these steps and I think the problem will be fixed. First, we have to know that the problem is caused by driver card, Wi-Fi card or the software. It is hardware issue or software issue. To do so, go to the start button, tap the source there, CMD and right click <coughs> and run as then after hit S, then after here type and spring 127.1.1 sorry 1.11 and hit enter in my case here is reply is showing there okay it means it is not the issue of the driver car it is the issue of the software issue OS issue okay if this reply comes then after this is the problem of the software that's harder devices right okay now next step is that you have to go to the start menu then after go to the control panel here control panel then after we have to go to the internet option here you can find out internet option then after go to the advanced option Then after click the restore setting, then after apply and OK. Next step is that press Windows R or type run and find out their run command and type their services.msc and click the OK. Yeah. <clears throat> services menu has been opened here and here we have to find out that um, while on auto config okay source from the w while on auto config this is the menu okay check the status this should be running and this should be the automatic okay if it is not running then after can start from here or right click and go to the properties then after you can find out here the start button or then after you always choose start or type automatic and apply then okay okay then after number four setting is go to the setting tab then after go to the network and internet Number change adapter setting. Change adapter setting. Then after check Wi-Fi. This is enable or disable. If it is disable, then after click the enable button. Okay. If it is enable, not connecting, then after disable and <coughs> again enable it. Okay. It may work. The next setting is from the Again, press the run command. Then her type there debmgmt.msc and hit enter. And here you have to find out the network adapters and find out the wireless adapters. Right click, then after update the driver, then close it. Right click, then after go to the properties go to the power management source and uncheck this button and ok ok then after restart your computer and check if it is working or not if not then after right click and uninstall the device ok then after go to the action button then after you scan for hardware changes now next method is that 
go to the setting then after go to the network and internet and here is network reset and click the reset okay after reset the computer will be restarted and problem may be fixed yeah from the next command is from the cmd okay go to cmd and right click and run satam station cache then after here we have to type some command any t s s win sock rscd reset then after type there any t s s int space ip reset reset lock txt hit enter then after press exit this command will clear all the locks okay all the locks from your ip4 version okay and after we start your computer and try whether it's connected or not in the wi-fi okay download the, the latest driver from the browser then after install it the last method is that resume plus r key then after type there msconfig and MS config. Then after go to the services tab okay if anything is on check then after click enable all okay then after apply okay and you have to restart your computer okay restart the computer and check whether resolved or not okay friend and thanks for watching my videos and uh, if if this solution fixed your problem then let me know in the comment section comment box okay and friends thanks for watching my videos see you in the next video thank you bye